Hello? 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 Hello, Hello. Hello welcome lady. back. Surprise, surprise. Hello, <laughs> hey, I'm so sorry for yesterday. Um, I really apologize for yesterday inconvenience. I'm sorry. You're welcome, teacher. Happy Valentine's. Happy Valentine's, by the way. Happy Valentine's. Thank you, Happy Valentine's. Happy Valentine's. You had a good Valentine's? Yes, teacher. Yes. With your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your husband, your wife, your best friends, your family. Right? Yes, teacher. I see him. Everybody. <laughs> Ooh, day of love. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm happy to see you one more time. Uh, again, I'm sorry for the inconvenience that happened yesterday. Nice so, to see you, teacher. Nice to see you again, brother. Brother from another mother. <laughs> okay. Entonces, la clase que perdimos ayer, lamentablemente, la vamos a reponer el viernes. Entonces, el viernes vamos a estar culminando. Right. Ah, ya me tacharon aquí a los que no. Ya me tacharon aquí los que nunca asistieron. Ok. Bueno, chicos. A ver, feedback. Feedback from last class. What do you remember from last class? Do you remember? Uh, yes, teacher. So, so. <laughs> yeah. Yes, no questions with the present continuous. Yes, teacher, teacher. yes. Uh, con respecto a eso de, lo, de, de que tacharon a quien no, no asistieron, eso de que ayer. No, de los que ya no pasan el módulo por lo de la ah, asistencia. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. Ya lo veo aquí en grisito. Tú, quiero ver, ¿cuál Está es tu bien. first name? David Sánchez. David Sánchez, David, David, David Sánchez. David. David. David Sánchez, es en serio. Bueno, ya vamos a verificar la asistencia porque no te vi, pero. Oh, let's go to the next module. <laughs> to the next module. <laughs> Vaya, vamos con la asistencia mejor antes que nada. Let's go with the attendance. Adam Wilfredo Arevalo Linares. In here, teacher. Great, this guy is so punctual. Alan Enrique Rosales Sorto. Alexandra Milena Rendon Saldana. Ana Gabriela Murillo Martinez. Hmm. Ana Margarita Marquez de Castillo. Ana Noemi Hernández de Moreira. Andrea Elizabeth González Burgos. Present teacher. Present teacher. Andrea Geraldine Sánchez Recinos. Present. Hmm. Ángel René Esquivel Landa Verde. I'm here, teacher. Present. Got it. Good evening, sir. Welcome. Ángela María Parada Castro. Antonio Alberto Martínez Pérez. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Bernardo Antonio Herrera Diaz. Present teacher. Thank you. Blanca Elizabeth Fuentes Menendez. Present teacher. All right. Blanca Jamilet Aquino Villa Mariona. Brian Isaac Escamilla Hernandez. Here I am. Perfect. Carlos Fernando Portillo. Tio Rivas. I'm here. Awesome. Carlos Manuel Ramos Epera. Here I am. Thank you. Carmen Guadalupe Escamilla Orantes. Present teacher. Already. Carmen Lisette Santillana de Retana. Present teacher. Wonderful. Next is Cesar Alejandro Ramos Epera. Here I am. Great. 
Cindy Marillo's Figueroa Mejia. Claudia Lisette Lopez Alvarado. Present. All right. Dalila del Carmen Romero Guerra. Present. ¿Cómo seguiste, Dalila? ¿Ya estás mejor? Sí, Excelente. Daniela Alejandra Candray Galvez. David Benjamín Aguirre Ayala. Present. And David Ezequiel Sánchez Muñoz. Here I am, teacher. Already, David Sánchez. Great, great, great. Teacher. Yes. Um, a mí creo que es que me mencionó, pero el audio estaba mal y me escuché cuando mencionó mi nombre. O sea, Ale. se cortó. Oh, yeah, Ale, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Alexandra <laughs> Milena Rendón. Sí. It's true, sí, es sí. correcto, no la escuché, mis. Vaya. Aquí estamos ya. Thank you. Gracias. All right. All right. Let me see. Let me share my screen. Let's see. Había una evaluación antes de llegar acá. Espero que estemos solventes. All right. It says. You sure? Yes. <coughs> Yo te, he tenido un problema. Hmm. Que cuando yo quiero, digamos, adjuntar el, el link de, de la plataforma de Bookero, ¿sí Bookero? ¿Ay? Yes, sir. Entonces, no me da ahí el, el, el espacio para poder pegar el link. Bye. Por ejemplo, de cada lección. Tengo mm -hmm. ese problema. Entonces, lo que he hecho... Es ir en una página de Word, he ido archivando, digamos, los links de, okay. la, de las lecciones, ¿verdad? Entonces, uh -huh. en su momento quizás los pueda agregar o, o voy a ver a qué se debe, pero sí tengo ese inconveniente ahorita. Vaya, vale, necesito sí, que te apoyes con Flor, ¿ok? Necesito que okay. visualices a Flor, quien es nuestra técnica a cargo de nuestro grupo. Eh, la puedes ver en nuestro grupo de WhatsApp, ahí en los contactos que están agregados. Y con toda confianza quiero que le escribas y que le pidas apoyo, ¿ok? okay. My pleasure. By the end of this class, you will be able Teacher, to... una consulta. Ok, dígame. Eh, no sé si estoy confundida, que hay que adjuntar algún audio de Bucarú a la plataforma. Bueno, tenía una tarea de un audio que era para la semana pasada, a más tardar domingo. Pero no era para ponerla en la plataforma, ¿verdad? Sino no, que era para eh, los... ah, bueno, sí era para problema. mandármelo a mí con el, con el link o por WhatsApp. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, yo pensé que era para ponerle la plataforma. <ríe> no, Borri, son trabajos así adicionales que les dejo. Ok. Ah, ok, teacher. Thank you. My pleasure. So, we'll, we'll be able to talk about different cities, different cities and international time zones. Additionally, you will practice a conversation between two people in a different time zone. All right. Yes, teacher. That being said, let's go. You're watching my screen, right? Are you watching my screen? Yes, yes teacher. teacher. Okay, awesome. Yes. Awesome. Yes, teacher. Hi, everyone. By the end of this class, you'll be able to talk about different cities and international time zones. Additionally, time zones. you will practice a conversation between two people in different time zones. Let's get started by listening to a short audio program to practice different cities around the world. Let's listen and repeat. Vancouver. Los Angeles. Repeat, guys. Vancouver. 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 Los Angeles. Los Angeles. You can say Los Angeles or you can say LA. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. LA. Los Angeles. LA. Mexico City. Mexico City. Mexico City. Lima. 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 
Lima. Lima. Lima. Montreal. 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 New York City. 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 San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. Brasilia. 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 Sao Paulo. 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 London. 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 Casablanca. 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 Cape Town. Cape Town. Cape Town. Cape Town. Warsaw. 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 Moscow. 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 Bangkok. Now let's listen to the conversation which illustrates the importance of understanding different time zones. Let's listen and repeat. Hello. Repeat. Hello. 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 Hi, Debbie. This is John. Hi, Debbie. 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 Hi, Deb
right. Oh, right. Oh, right. Oh, right. Oh, right. 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 What time is it Right. What time is it there? What It's 10 p.m. It's 10 p.m. And it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? And uh, it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? There in Los Angeles. English. It's ten p.m. And it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? Right? Yes. Four o'clock in the morning. Right. Yes. Yes. Four o'clock in the morning. Yes. Four o'clock in the morning. Four o'clock in the morning. Four o'clock in the morning. Yes. Yes. In the morning. Four o'clock in the morning. Four o'clock in the morning. Four o'clock in the morning. Four. Okay. Oh, I'm really sorry. Oh, I'm really sorry. Four a.m. Four a.m. Four a.m. Four a.m. Oh, a.m. I'm really sorry. Oh, oh I'm, I'm really, really sorry. Four a.m. Oh, I'm really sorry. Oh, I'm really sorry. Repeat, repeat. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I am really sorry. I am really, really sorry. sorry. That's okay. I'm awake now. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. I am awake now. I am awake now. now. Okay, I am awake now. And also, I would like for you. Uh -uh. Okay, questions on this conversation? No question. Okay. Vaya, eh, let me see, let me see, let me see. Cuando preguntamos la hora, usualmente decimos, what time is it? Hasta donde está el it. Y cerramos el question mark. Repeat, what time is it? What time is it? What time is it? Ahora, ¿qué hora es? What time is it? 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 Ok, tenemos la palabra here que es aquí, y tenemos la palabra there, repeat, there, there. que significa allá, ¿verdad? Allá. Entonces, si yo digo, what time is it, ¿qué hora es? Si yo digo, what time is it, there, es que hora es allá, allá. allá correcto, quiere decir que la otra persona está en otro lugar, en otra zona, right Diferente de donde yo estoy. Here and there. Ok. Uh, what else? What else? Cuando él dice, 
I am really sorry. Entendieron la magnitud de esa disculpa? Porque yes. decir solo I'm sorry está bien, me disculpo, pero si usted dice I am really sorry, es que realmente usted está realmente. wow, apenado, está apenado, con mucha pena, verdad, que pues quedó mal, verdad. I'm really sorry. Si entendió ahí el contexto, it's 10 p.m. in Los Angeles. But it's, um, no, no, it's 10 p.m. in Sydney, right? And, and, and John is calling Debbie, but Debbie is in Los Angeles. And what time is it in Los Angeles, guys? 4 a.m. 4 a.m. John thought that it was 4 p.m. in Los Angeles, so he was calling Debbie, but he didn't realize that it was 4 in the morning. So that was a very big mistake <laughs> let's go ahead and repeat let's go ahead and practice this conversation all my students are going to be debbie teacher kalev is going to interpret jones role are you ready ready teacher. i'm ready let's go students let's practice english three two one you go hello, hello. hello. hi oh, debbie this is John. I am calling from Australia. 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 I am at a conference in Sydney. Remember? All right. What time is it? Well, it's um, 10 p.m. And it's 4 o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? Yes. 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 Awake. 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 I'm awake. Awake. I'm 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 I am, I am awake, awake, now. awake now. I'm awake. I'm awake now. I'm awake now. Ya estoy despierta, ¿verdad? Ya estoy despierto. Ya que más da, ¿verdad? <laughs> okay. So, teacher Caleb's turn is Debbie. You guys are John. Ready? I'm ready. Right. Hello? Hello. Hi, Hi, Debbie. Hi, Debbie. This is John. It's John. I'm calling from, 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 from Australia. Australia. Australia? Australia? I have a number. Is this Yes. Four o'clock in the morning. That's okay. I am awake now. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Vaya. Esa palabrita, really, really. I am really sorry. Y esa palabra, right, R-I-G-H-T, pongan la parte, por favor. Tiene bastantes significados dependiendo del contexto. Si se fijaron, eh, al principio él le dijo... Um, I'm at, a, I'm at a conference in Sydney, remember? Estoy en una conferencia en Sydney, ¿no te acuerdas? Y ella le dice, oh, right. ¿Qué quiere decir ahí? Correcto. Oh, es cierto. Oh, es, cierto. cierto. es correcto. Estoy acknowledging, estoy confirmando, para confirmar, ¿verdad? 
y vean, es verdad, es cierto. Y, y al final ella dice, and it's four o'clock there, el John dice, it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles. Right? Pero en signo de pregunta, ¿qué quiere decir ahí? Que estaba no. como pidiendo confirmación. Ahí, ahí hay pupusas. Correcto, no, no, no significa ahí hay pupusas, solo quiere decir correcto. Es como la palabra correct, right? Correct. Es como que le haya dicho, it's, and it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles, correct? Pero él dijo, right? right. Para confirmar, right. ¿ok? Capich? Me ha buscado. Capich. All right, all right, all right. Now, I want to listen, ladies and gentlemen. I want to listen, Jen, ladies and gentlemen, okay? Uh, let me see. All the girls, all the ladies are going to be Debbie, and all the boys, all the gentlemen are going to interpret John's role. Por favor, pongámosle naturalidad, naturalism a esta conversación. Ready? Ready. Ready, teacher. Yes. Ladies and star, ladies and star, you're Debbie on three, two, one. Let's go. Hello. 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 Hi, Debbie. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Debbie. This is John. I am calling I'm from, from, from Australia. 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 I am a okay. I am a doctor. Remember? 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 Oh, oh right. 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 That, that is it. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. It's 10 p.m. It's 4 o'clock. It's 4 o'clock. Right. 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 Yes. 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 Right. Yes. 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 Awake. Right. Awake. 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 Naturalicemos la pronunciación de qué hora es. What time is it? What time is it? Everybody, what time is it? 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 Ahí podemos especificar en vez del it puedo sustituir. What time is your class? Repeat, what no. time is your class? What time is your class? All right, very good. What time is your class? All right, all right. Good practice, guys. What time is your class? Good practice. Good practice. Guys. Good practice. Good practice. Good morning. Continue. 4 a.m.? Oh, I'm really sorry. That's okay. I'm awake now. Uh, now it's your time uh, to practice the conversation which is heard. And also, I'd like for you to answer the following questions in our discussion forums. By looking at the map, which cities are in the same time zone? Which cities are in your time zone? Very well, very well. Let me close this window. We're going to move on. So far, so good. So far, so good. We're going to see now answer questions using time expression and practice giving the time. Vamos a aprender a dar la hora. Let's watch out. Let's watch out. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn to ask and answer questions using time expressions. Let's get started by looking at some clocks which are expressing the time. Let's listen and repeat. It's one o'clock. It's one o'clock. One Repeat, guys. It's one o'clock. It's, it's, it's one o'clock. It's one o'clock. Clock. Clock. ¿Cuándo vamos a usar esa expresión o'clock? Cuando la hora es en punto. Es correcto. O'clock. Podemos decir o'clock. Le voy a enseñar otra forma de decirlo. También podemos decir sharp. Sharp. Okay. sharp. Usted puede decir sharp. it's one o'clock. Or it's one sharp. Sharp. 
Yeah? Sure. How do you say in English? Ojo, esa palabra, it's, necesito que me la usen siempre antes de dar la hora. Porque es como cuando en español usted dice, son las, ¿verdad? Entonces no lo evadan. It's one o'clock. How do you say, son las cinco en punto? It's five o'clock. Five it's five o'clock. Or it's five sharp. Or it's five sharp. 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 It's 10 o'clock. Or it's 10 sharp. Or it's 10 sharp. What time, what time does this English class start? It's 8 o'clock. o'clock. It's 8 o'clock or 8 sharp. Let's continue. It's one oh five. It's one oh five. One oh five. One oh five. One oh five. It's one oh five. 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 It's five oh five. It's five oh five. It's one. It's one oh five. 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 One oh five. One oh five. Or you can say it's five after one. It's Puedo usar la palabra after. Puedo usar la palabra past. Usted puede decir it's five after one, or you can say it's five past one. Estoy diciendo que son cinco minutos pasadas. La una. La una. Okay. El after se usa cuando ya pasan. Pasada la hora, es correcto. En este caso, si estamos hablando de una hora, que es desde las 01 hasta las 09 minutos, usted puede decir O1. O1. Por ejemplo, es 101. Repeat, es 101. It's one It's one Una y uno. Ajá. Usted puede decir it's one o two. Repeat, it's one o two. It's one o two. It's one o two. con dos minutitos. Ajá. Repeat, it's one o three. It's one o three. Repeat, guys, it's one o four. It's one o four. Repeat, it's 105. It's 105. It's 106. It's 107. It's 107. It's 108. It's 109. It's 109. Tenemos que decir AM, si es AM, repeat AM. AM. O podemos decir in the morning. 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 A.M. 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 P.M. Si es en la tarde. P.M. 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 Or. Or. In the afternoon. 
The afternoon. The afternoon. PM. In the afternoon. In the afternoon. Puedo decir PM si ya son las 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. O puedo decir at night. At night. At night. Ojo, ahí ya no es in the night, ¿verdad? No se vayan a equivocar. In the solo puedo usar um, in the morning, in the afternoon. Sí, a las seis y las siete, correcto. Permítanme que le voy a poner acá in the evening que me faltaba. In the evening. ¿Cuándo vamos a usar in the evening? Cuando sean las seis, las siete, incluso las ocho. Cuando ya sean las nueve para adelante, vamos a decir at night. At night. Mm -hmm. At night. Ok. Very well, let's continue. Entonces, cuando ya pasan los minutos, vamos a usar after o no vamos a usar past. Por ejemplo, what time is it here? It's chat. It's one. 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 Vaya, primero demos la forma normal que en español sería son la una con diez. It's one. It's one. It's one. It's one. It's one. Correct. It's one. It's one. It's one. It's 1.10 p.m. a.m. in the morning, mm -hmm. right? In the afternoon, right? Okay. ¿Qué otra forma puedo usar? It's 1. It's 10 uh, after 1. It's 10 after 1. Puedo decir it's 10 after 1. Correct. It's 10 after 1. ¿Qué estoy diciendo? Que son 10 minutos. Pasada la una. Podemos usar la otra palabrita. It's ten. Past. Past. One. One. Excelente. Es bueno aprenderlo de diferentes formas. Ok. Sigamos. It's five after one. It's one fifteen. Repeat. It's one fifteen. It's one fifteen. One fifteen. One fifteen. It's one fifteen. It's one fifteen. It's one fifteen. It's one fifteen. And uh, water. Como quieran ustedes decir fifteen, el número tal cual. Fifteen. Fifteen. Or in a quarter. In a quarter. 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 Quarter after one. Quarter. Repeat. It's one fifteen. Quarter. It's one fifteen. One fifteen. It's one fifteen. La forma normal. It's one fifteen. Ponemos el uno. Ponemos un dash. Saben qué es un dash? Guión. Un guión. Un guión, correcto. Entonces, en la escritura vamos a poner justo como está en el libro, ¿verdad? It's one dash 15, si lo ponemos en letras. It's one 15. La otra forma, it's a quarter after one. It's a quarter after one. It's one 30. Uh, it's one thirty. It's one thirty. Ese número es dificilísimo. Damos la Z y después como la R con la I. Thirty. Thirty. Pueden decir 30 yeah. o pueden decir and a half. Repeat and a half. 
and a half. And a half. The letter, the letter L, the letter L is silent. So you say half. In a half. 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 Y eso lo especificamos PM o AM It's one It's one and a half PM por ejemplo It's one and a half PM Mucha gente dice It's it's half Por ejemplo lo dicen de la forma que estamos aprendiendo ¿Verdad? It's half ¿Cómo sería? It's half Correct. Algunos after dicen one. half after one. It's half after one. No puede, se puede. No es muy común, ¿verdad? Es más común decir it's one thirty or it's one and a half. Aunque también usted puede decir es media hora pasada, ¿verdad? It's half after one. It's half after two. Right. Next. Ahora vamos al otro lado, ¿verdad? Cuando faltan ciertos minutos para llegar a la siguiente hora. ¿Qué palabras vamos a usar tú? Vamos a usar aquí, vamos a usar tú. Vamos a usar before. Cualquiera de las dos puede usar. Let's continue. It's 1.40. Repeat. Normal, normal. It's 1.40. It's 1.40. It's 1.40. It's one it's one one four. 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 Or, or it's 20 to 2. Falta 20 para las dos. Aunque suene ahí 2 to 2, ¿verdad? Algo. <laughs> it's 20 to 2. It's 20 to 2. It's 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20 to 2. Correct. It's 20 to 2. It's 20 to 2. Or we can say it's 20 before 2. It's 20 before 2. All right. All right. It's 1.45. It's 1.45. It's 1.45. Or it's a quarter to two. 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 Or it's a quarter before two. It's a quarter before two. Ok, very good. Esto es para dar la, la hora, guys. Cuando damos la hora. Cuando damos la hora, ¿cuál? Por ejemplo, yo les pregunto a ustedes. What time is it in this moment? It's 8.43. It's 8.43. It's 8.43. It's 8.43. I got 8.44. 8.44 p.m. Yes. It's 8.44 p.m. Podemos decir que es casi como que it's a quarter to night. To nine. Or it's a quarter before 9 p.m. or a.m. p.m. p.m. at night or in the morning? At, at night. night. At night. Very well, guys. Let's continue. It's a quarter to two. Now, what we want to do is make our own examples by changing the time on those clocks. I'm going to change the time for each and express a different time. Let's do it. Instead of one o'clock, we will say two. Notice that the only thing that we will change is the number for now. It's two o'clock. For our uh, next example, it's 2.05. After that, it's 2.15. Then it's 2.30 or it's half past two. Next, it's 2.40 or it's 20 to three. Our last example, it's a quarter to three or it's 2.45. I would like for you to 
the rest of the time now. I will give you the numbers and you should write the time. Okay, how do you say tres en punto? It's three o'clock. 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 Three Sería bien descomunal que usted me diga it's 305 porque aquí pues sustituimos el 0 con el O, ¿verdad? Ok. Por ejemplo, it's 305 in the afternoon. Repeat. It's 305 in the afternoon. It's 305 in the morning. Repeat. It's 3.05 a.m. It's 3.05 a.m. Next, what time is it? It's 3.15. Forma normal, it's 3. Forma normal, it's 3. It's 3.15. Okay, it's 3.15. 3.15 Puedo decir, it's 3.15 Puedo decir, it's 3 and a quarter It's 3 and a quarter Very well, very well Next, what time is it? It's 3 and a half Correct. It's three and a half. It's three and a half. Hey, la forma normal, ¿cómo sería? La forma normal, las tres treinta. It's three thirty. 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 Three and a half p.m. Three and a half. Hay otra forma todavía. Hay otra forma. ¿Cuál sería? It's four. It's half. It's half. It's half after half after three. Yes. It's half after three. Y si está entendiendo esa forma es porque usted ha comprendido muy bien. Okay. 3.40. What, what time is it? 3.40. It's 3.40. It's 3.40. Okay, okay, okay. Other way, other form? 3.40. It's 24. Wait, wait. It's 20? 20 before 4. It's 20 before 4. It's 20. Puedo decir, it's 20 before 4. O puedo decir, it's 20. 20 before. Ya usé before. It's 20 to 4. It's 20 to 4. No, 24, ¿verdad? It's 20 to 4. O sea, faltan 20 para las 4. Al decirlo rápido puede que no lo entendamos. So be careful. It's 20 to 4. 
It's 20 to 4. It's 20 to 4 p.m. Repeat, it's 20 before 4 p.m. Repeat, it's 3.40. It's 3.40. Okay, the last one. What time is it? It's, it's quarter, quarter to four. Vamos, se dice quarter o se dice a quarter? A quarter. A quarter. Okay, okay. A quarter. It's a quarter to four. To four. To four. To four. To four. To four. It's a quarter before four. PM. PM, AM. Vaya. Si es desde el inicio va a ser AM, ¿verdad? AM in the morning. ¿Ok? In the morning. Tomemos nota, tomemos nota. Sería desde el qué? Desde las cero horas, ¿verdad? No, a las cero horas sería medianoche. Entonces sería desde la 1 a 0, 1. ¿Hasta qué? Hasta las 11.59 sería AM. AM or in, in the morning. The morning. No me pueden decir on the morning, no me pueden decir at the morning, me tienen que decir in, in the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Teacher, si fuera in the morning. Morning. Ahí vamos, por ahí vamos ahorita. Si son las 12 p.m., vamos a decir. It's 12 o'clock. It's 12 o'clock. O podemos decir it's noon. In the noon. In the noon. It's noon. It's noon. It's es noon. mediodía, son las 12 pues, 12 It's cabalitos. It's noon. It's PM, noon. ¿verdad? PM es ahí. It's It's noon. Day. Vaya, de ahí de la 1 hasta las 5:59, no, uh, ya, yeah, de la 1 hasta las 5:59 vamos a decir PM o vamos a decir in the, in the afternoon. Ah, y entendí yo que noon es mediodía y after es después, entonces afternoon es la tarde, ¿verdad? Afternoon. <ríe> ok. Oh. <ríe> ya cuando oh. llego a las seis, ya cuando llego a las seis, a las siete, hasta las siete, ocho, ocho y media, ocho cincuenta y nueve, voy a decir siempre p.m. or in the evening. Correcto, mm -hmm. in the evening. Cuando nos saludamos a las 8, usted no me puede decir good night, teacher, hello. No, no se puede, porque good night es una despedida. Decir hola en la noche, vamos a decir hello, good evening. Ok. Hello, good evening. Ok. okay. Vaya, entonces, de las 9 en adelante, vamos a decir at night. Vamos a decir pm or. At night. At, night. At, night. At night. Y si ya se fijaron, este, in the, in the lo usamos, in the morning, yeah. in the afternoon, yeah. in the evening. Evening. Y at, at noon, at noon, repeat, at noon, at noon, at night, at noon, at night. At night. Y a las 12 de la medianoche, at midnight. At midnight. At midnight. At midnight. En la medianoche. Para decir, son las 12 de la noche, vamos a decir, it's. At midnight. It's midnight. Si son las 12 de la noche, right? ¿Alguna pregunta hasta acá? It's midnight. No, teacher. Vaya, esto es para Michelle, dar la hora. Porque se, ¿por qué se ocupa en algunas ocasiones in y por qué en otras ocasiones se ocupa at. Por eso lo quiero explicar, por eso lo he detallado, porque hay mucha confusión con esas preposiciones. ¿okay? Por eso necesito que tomen nota. ¿okay? Eh, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. At. No, pero también, también en lugares y también este. Eh, como le explico, en cosas también. 
Claro, estas Porque preposiciones no solo son preposiciones de tiempo. Es lo bueno, guys, que estas preposiciones tienen diferentes usos. Podemos hacer uso de estas preposiciones para dar el tiempo, para dar la hora. En este caso, eso es lo que estamos viendo. Eh, también podemos hacerlo para dar las direcciones. Se ocupan mucho las preposiciones, ¿verdad? On Main Street, sobre la calle principal, etc. In the corner of, en la esquina de. También se ocupa para preposiciones de lugar. Cuando yo quiero decir que un objeto está en cierto lugar, está encima de algo, está debajo de algo. Entonces, las preposiciones, créanmelo, son muy útiles. Entonces, este es solo uno de tantos usos de las preposiciones que se usa con el tiempo, ok entonces, cuando yo les digo, what time is it ahí sí vamos a usar it, damos la hora, ok si yo les hago preguntas puntuales, por ejemplo what time what time do you get up escuchamos esa pregunta, solo me le ponen ahí el signo de interrogación, porfa what time what time do you Get up. Right. Repeat, get up. Get, get, up. Up. get up. ¿A qué horas te levantas? Usted get va a decir, I get up. I get up. Y ahí sí vamos a darle por la preposición at. Cuando nos hagan estas preguntas así puntuales de una hora, vamos a dar la información de la hora y antes vamos a necesitar la preposición at. At es la preposición que siempre voy a usar para dar la hora. What time do you get up? I get up. Uh, I get up late. Eight, What eight, time do you get up? Morning. I'm sorry. I get up at six. Six o'clock in the morning. Six o'clock in the morning. Great. You're an early bird. I get up at seven in the morning. <laughs> What time do you get up? What time do you get up? Huh? Tell me. I get up. Nine a.m. Nine a.m. I get up. Um, six o'clock. Okay, I get up at six o'clock in the morning. I get up at six o'clock in the morning. Hey, Carmen, Santiana, what time do you get up? I get up at six o'clock in the morning. Wonderful. What time do you get up, Andrea Gonzalez? Uh, I am get up at five o'clock in the morning. Five o'clock in the morning. What about you, Carmen Escamilla? What time do you get up? No es que sea nosy, ¿verdad? Pero... A manera de práctica. Ajá, Andrea Geraldine, what time do you get up? Um, at five o'clock in the morning. Five o'clock in the morning. What about you, David Benjamin? What time do you get up? I get up at, and you give the time. What time, what time do you finish what time do you... your day what time oh. do you finish your day Cesar Ramos I finish at midnight <gasps> wow <laughs> this is a money maker this guy is a money maker <laughs> what about what about you Claudia Lopez what time do you finish your day uh, my day finish uh, at 11 o'clock at at 11 o'clock very good very good what about you adam wilfredo what time do you finish your day i i finish my day at mm, 12 Uh, Midnight. Uh, quarter. I qu uh, quarter after twelve. Quarter after twelve. Oh my goodness! <laughs> so that's in the morning. Be careful. Be careful. Okay, guys. Nice practice. 
Vamos a cerrar with calling attendance. Vamos a ver. Alan Enrique Rosales. Sorto. Present teacher. Thank you. Ana Gabriela Murillo Martinez. Ana Margarita Márquez de Castillo. Present teacher. Thank you. Ángela María Parada Castro. Present teacher. Wonderful. Okay. Blanca Jamilet Aquino Villa Mariona. Present teacher. Thank you. And then Cindy Marielos Figueroa Mejía. Missing in action. Daniela Alejandra Candray Galvez. Missing in action. And that's it. Guys, thank you for your attention. Go to your bed. Go get some sleep. All right. Mm -hmm. I'll see you tomorrow. At what time? Eight o'clock in the in the morning. In the, you know, at night. Nine. <laughs> All right. Nine. See you later. Nine. See you at 8 p.m. Good night, see everyone. Say goodbye. Nine. Say goodbye. Nine. Nine. Bye. 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 See you later, alligators. Yes, teacher. Bye-bye. 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 So long.